are worried. So what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. What are you doing in my dorm? You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho. <clears throat> Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. You are so fucking dead! Uh, uh, Get off me, bro! Uh, oh. uh. Warren, stop it! Come on! Oh, oh my head! Why are y'all looking at me like that, huh? You and you! You're all dead! Let's go, now! Plus? My dad is on his way. You're all fucked. He owns you. Damn. You like to hurt people, huh? Like Max? Like Kate? Like me? Huh? Feel this, motherfucker! Get off me! Please! Please stop! He's down! Hey, come on! Stop. <laughs> Sorry. Yes, we have to go. Who's the bitch now? Chloe. Damn, Warren went full alpha on Nathan. And it was good, but scary. Shit, man. This really hurts. Damn, Max, you're finally back. I got worried. So what did you find? His room was clean and creepy. Check this out. Boom, Nathan. We got you by the balls, fucker. What are you doing in my dorm? You're such a nosy bitch, Max. Stop right there, Nathan. Make me ho. <clears throat> Max, I got this. Get the fuck out of my face. <clears throat> you are so fucking dead. <clears throat> Get off me, bro. <clears throat> <clears throat> Stop it! Damn, that was intense. Warren, uh, th thank you so much. For what? 
for headbutting Nathan Prescott. That was awesome. I don't know. I almost went crazy there. Like Nathan. You're not anything like him. Good to know. So where are you going? I better stick with you guys. Just in case you need me to get my Hulk on again. Or should I call the cops on Nathan? No police. Not yet. Uh, so maybe you better, um... Warren, me and Max have to do this on our own. No offense. It's cool. Whatever I can do to help. What you can do is find out anything you can about Nathan's father. I'm on it. Between the snow and eclipse, I'm assuming the apocalypse is around the corner. And thank you. Seriously. I'll call you later. You better. I'm feeling pretty alpha now. Yes, you are. Man, that guy is so fucking in love with you. I know. He really did give a serious beatdown to Nathan. It was a little scary to watch him do that. Now let's make a date with Frank. Will he even answer you? Frank always answers when he wants money. Like I said, Frank wants to see me right now. Let's not keep him waiting. I hate seeing those poor whales like that. Me too. I just think of their families in the ocean out there looking for them. Well, that asshole's gonna help us find Rachel. You know what would be great? If I still had a gun. Yes, the chance for gunplay would just about even the odds here. Frank would scare better. He's a pussy. Besides, if I take him out, you can just rewind. Chloe, do not count on my rewind. Seriously. After Kate, I feel like every time I do, it might be the last. There's no way we could have guessed this is what would happen to us when we grew up. I'm looking forward to the day when we can just go on a road trip to Portland. Fuck yeah. You, me, and Rachel. Absolutely. So let's play this cool, okay? Just talk to Frank so we can get that code for the book from him. That's all. Got it. No dicking around. Let's roll. Nope, I don't want to go there. The forest seemed quiet. There's no sign of life. Or deer. There might not be any Pan Estates by Saturday. This is where my nightmare started. No worries, sign. How can all of this not be connected to a major storm?
I may not know quantum speak, but there has to be an explanation. It blows my mind that I was just here with Chloe in an alternate reality. I may not know quantum speak, but there has to be an explanation. Good thing there are no actual cops around to bust us. Can't see inside with this shit blocking the view. Take the trash out sometime, dude. This is where Frank ponders his existence and gets drunk. Oh, fresh meat. So Pompidou must be okay. Good doggy. Chloe looks ready to rumble. Oh, look. The Wonder Twins. You should have come alone. She's my partner. Yeah, we're bodyguard. So let's get to business. Where's my fucking money? I... I don't have the money. Yet. Oh, really? Then why did you text me that you did? Because I wanted to tell you in person. Oh, I'm truly touched, Chloe. Now why are you losers really here? We just want to ask you some questions. You have some serious lady balls. <laughs> no. Jesus, okay, okay. But I'm not getting you high. Frank, we're not here to get high. No, you don't look like the type. Not like Chloe here. So what do you hardy boys want? Just the names of some of your clients. Oh, is that all? Oh, well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? You don't get it, man. This is for a good cause. No, man, I do not get it. Especially from a weirdo like you. You know, I hate the way you talk to me like you, like you know more than I do. No, no, I'm not, I, I... Oh, Christ, I hate you, Blackwell, shits. You expect everything for free. You're not getting any handouts from me. I work for a living, you understand? Yes, Frank, without those Blackwell shits as customers, you wouldn't have any work at all. Dude, you're a drug dealer. You snobby whores. Don't come into my home and judge me. That's why I go to church. And you want something from me? How about a blade up the ass, huh? Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. Do not ever tell me what to do. Whoa! Get off of me! Motherfucker! <laughs> Listen, Chloe, I can tell you for a fact that this will not go well. Max, I should have known you would be kind and rewind. So tell me exactly what I need to do here. Please watch your mouth. You have no social skills here and you will piss off Frank immediately. You kind of love this, don't you? Fine, I'll try being like...